On Veterans Day, many people will take the day to remember and also honor those who have served by contributing to charities and other nonprofit organizations that were created to help military service members. The challenge is how to make a wise giving decision. Better Business Bureau is offering some advice to help donors make the most impact and avoid any potential scams when giving this holiday. Well, here with some more tips, we have got Sean Rose from the Better Business Bureau joining us this morning. And Veterans Day is coming up later on this week, mm -hmm. so a lot of folks are wanting to give back to the veterans who've done so much for us. What should we be doing whenever looking at some of the organizations that are out there? Yeah, I mean, you know, and the first thing you always want to do is kind of make sure that you learn all about the charity before you give. Um, BBB has a great um, program organization called the Wise Giving Alliance, and so we go through and kind of vet charities, let you kind of know a little bit more about how they spend their money, what they're spending their money on, you know, who's where in the organization and whether or not it's a legitimate organization. Wait, explain a little bit. So that's cool. So it, it, does it show like the percentage of how much they give back to the um, So it'll kind of show to an extent like where the different funds have been allocated, I think. Um, and so it's all there at give.org. It's basically, it's like BBB, but for charities. That's um, really cool. So we always recommend people go there first, check it out. Um, there's some great national uh, charities that give back to, to veterans that are accredited with them. And, you know, it's, it's a good, good resource for people. What are some potential scams that you, maybe you guys have seen in the past or that are currently around? I mean, you know, the look-alike charities, somebody that claims that they might be a certain organization, have the website that looks like a certain organization, but they're not. Mm. Um, you can get a scam email that says, hey, you know, it's Veterans Day coming up. Make sure you give to this charity. You click on the link. It takes you to a site that's not that charity, um, infects your computer with malware, um, or even takes a donation that doesn't even go anywhere close to the charity. So It's so hard to know these days, mm -hmm. though. I mean, these scammers try to make these websites look so legitimate. Mm -hmm. um, what can we do to even tell if it's a real one or a fake one? I mean, you know, the first thing you want to do is you just ask a lot of questions. If somebody's calling you or contacting you, um, make sure that you're kind of asking all the right questions. You know, are you a telemarketer for the charity or are you actually a member of the charity? Um, if you go to the website, make sure that it has that HTTPS, because obviously the S means secure, so that means your transaction is going to be secure, your financial information is going to be protected, and you're going to be able to support that charity. Um, and the biggest thing is we always say is donate directly to a charity. Like if you've heard of a charity that works with veterans or an organization that might work with, you know, people who have been in the service or still in the service, mm -hmm. go directly to their website. Mm -hmm. um, but the you know the best thing is one of the best resources is give.org. Okay. So we would always say go check it out there first, maybe go to their website and kind of do a little research and then go ahead and give that gift. There are some great organizations for veterans, mm -hmm. so uh, you know we want to make sure that we are giving to the correct uh, organization right. there. And if you'd like more information, um, you can go to oklahomacity.bbb.org. You can also call 405-239-6081 if you need help with anything, if you want more information uh, in general, and we'll be right back right here on KAUT.